Good evening and thanks for watching KRX 5 News at 10. I'm Ivan Fisher. A disgruntled homeless man carried a bomb into a business today, sending innocent people into the streets, calling out the bomb squad and causing a major avenue to be shut down. And now our Rob Hagan was first on the scene and stands by live in studio with more. So Rob, exactly what took place today? That's right, Ivan. KREX was on the scene at North Avenue and 16th Street late this afternoon when the bomb squad was called out as a beautiful Sunday afternoon is disrupted. This quiet Sunday afternoon was shattered when a lonely homeless man wandered into this business on North Avenue. Police say he dropped a bomb and set off a furious chain of reactions. Right now what we've got is a good perimeter set up and what our officers are responsible for doing is making sure that people can um, use convenient alternate routes if they're in a vehicle. Also making sure to clear out any residential areas that might be in the area that, that could be um, threatened. The Grand Junction Police Department responded quickly and the bomb squad was called in and the bomb was detonated. What you just heard moments ago is the second controlled explosion to disable the device that was used earlier today at Mad Max post-apocalyptic smoke shop. Channel 5 News spoke to an employee at Mad Max post-apocalyptic smoke shop where the bomb was dropped. And while he did not want to appear on camera, he told our news team the homeless man walked into the store, told employees he was having a bad day, and was carrying a large backpack with what appeared to contain a pipe bomb. The employee also told 5 News the man started acting hysterically, began jumping up and down and dropped the bag, setting off the explosion. That's when the bomb squad was called in. We responded. We were able to locate one person who had minor injuries. Uh, the, the building was immediately evacuated, and officers are responding now to determine what the item was, make sure that the building is structurally sound and that there's no danger to anyone in the immediate area. Now, the homeless man who started all this in motion was slightly injured from the explosion and is in custody tonight. First on the Western Slope and live in the studio, I'm Rob Hagan with KREX 5 News.